Hey folks, Quilly Team here, and welcome back to Let's Play Two Point Hospital, the upcoming game made by the same people who made the fantastic Theme Hospital about a million years ago. One of my favorite games, and many people's many favorite games. We've got our doctors over here. Dr. Claire Hurricane over here he is going for a break. Uh, although he may have just changed his mind, I'm not sure. Uh, did you know patients and staff become thirsty over time? Provide drinks around the hospital to keep them happy. What do we do? Oh, there you go. That's what the doctor is doing. Getting himself, oh, actually, a snack, or herself a snack. Mmm, cheesy grubbins. Lovely. Although it looked kind of like a chocolate bar to me. So we got a break room over here. We've got our ward. We've cured some patients of lightheadedness. We did achieve our first star, which did unlock the next map. But I mean, can't go in over here till we cure the 25 patients. Uh, we're just gonna go and increase the speed and we'll probably expand this hospital a little bit to see if we can encourage more people to, to come over here. Reputation is pretty good overall. We may need some more, um, just a, a few extra redundant doctors. Eh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, it's not too, too bad. What were you looking for over here? Were you looking for something to put down? Very bored. Yeah, but we've got this little, uh, we've got this bookshelf for you. Okay, that seems to have helped some, with some of the board when you went and browsed the books. That's fantastic. We'll see if we can get like a, a lounge or some televisions or stuff set up at some point. We might want some extra benches for people, although people mostly seem to be sitting down, which makes you quite pleased. Oh, awards and yearly review. Let's view this awards countdown. Okay, well those are the awards. I guess we have to wait for the countdowns to start, or did I did I just pop out of that too quickly? Did something happen? Oh, we did get an award, Rising Star. Awarded to the medical professional who improved the most this year. Uh, times one, one, last one by Dr. Raj Deek. Hey, congratulations, Raj. This is one of our doctors, improved the most. I mean, there's really nowhere to go from then, you know, anywhere um, over here. Uh, let's get an extra doctor. I think a little bit of redundancy in the doctorage would actually be handy. Uh, Herbert Vibes over here is very good. You know what? Let's get ourselves a professional, a real, real excellent doctor. Get that started. Well done. The hospital levels increase. Keep expanding to attract more patients and staff. Okay, I guess I will go and expand the hospital some more. Since we actually, we do need to get the level six. And that is based on the size of the hospital as well as the um, amount of staff we have. So we've got two of these GP offices. We could get another special diagnostic office. I guess I will. Over here. Excellent. And we'll, we'll decorate it as well. well. We'll get the prestige level up. Keep it, uh, keep people very happy. A plant. A bin. Oh, it's already level two. We can get a poster. There we are. And done. Oh, I think, yeah, I overlapped with the poster there. That's fine. We may need to hire an extra nurse. Got some reading. Are you just looking for a recycle spot? Do you not have a bin in the room? I suppose that might be true. Let's get ourselves another janitor. Just a, just a low level is going to be fine. Just want another body here. Keep the, the level going up. And yeah, it looks like like this. We're going to cure people fairly quickly. Oh, there you found a bin. So you're okay there. Hmm. Unless we build another giant ward. I mean, our current ward's not really being hammered that hard. Tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to say I want an extra staff over here. Might have too many nurse or doctors. I think it's going to be okay. I'm going to need another nurse. Uh, another ward manager. Yes, that's going to be swell. We're going to get you in here. Keep it going. You know, just make sure we've got plenty of spare people. Treat people as quickly as possible. And again, we might get the level up. If need be, I'll build another giant sort of ward over here. Staff rooms. Yeah, we've got everything we've got. Well, maybe what I'll do, actually, is rather than pursue the two stars, because I said I was going to get two stars and then switch to, the, um, to another hospital, but maybe what I'll do is I will I will just go to another hospital now so that we can unlock more room types and more diseases and then we can come back and fill this with these new types of rooms. I think that's going to be a swell idea. So let's go and do that. We're going to return to the map over here. Rise and shine, everyone. Ooh, hello. And if you happen to be in Lower Bullocks this morning, watch out for the gathering of druids down at Grogben's Ring. In a total coincidence, the town will also pay host to a psychology convention today. Should all work out nicely. Uh-huh, that sounds fine. What could possibly go wrong? 
So, we got our one star over here. We're going to move over here. And lower bullocks. Expand the organization by establishing a second hospital. Now, each one of these regions will have different issues, different diseases, different requirements, different ability to hire staff, and so on and so forth. Uh, different weather, uh, heating and cooling will be important. Expand the organization, establishing a second hospital. So I don't, it didn't sound like there was necessarily anything extraordinary about this location. Welcome to Lower Bullocks. It's a lovely little village with a big problem. A significant proportion of the population believe themselves to be rock stars. There's only one thing that can cure this, psychiatry. Only doctors with a psychiatry qualification will be able to diagnose and treat people in a psychiatry room. We've managed to find one, but you should keep your eye peeled for job applicants with psychiatry and other useful qualifications. Oh, that is very interesting. So we have to build a psychiatry. So we've got a, our basic little diagnostic room. This is a very pretty, very pretty little room they went and designed. Could you put down a different carpet? I don't know if they did that or if I'm imagining it. So, psychiatry. I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna put it right behind here. Uh, maybe we don't want the, well, oh, no, that's fine. We'll do this. It needs to be probably three by three, but we'll put the three by four, that's okay. And I'll put the door right back here. So we're gonna get an armchair. Let's, uh, let's put you there and then the couch. I kind of want to go, oh, I was going to say, I want to be able to do it like an angle. I didn't realize, I wonder if, I don't think everything can be put at 45 degree angles like that. That feels pretty good. That's all they need, but let's go ahead. And it's already prestige two, probably a combination of size and whatnot, but we'll need a filing cabinet. I mean, a bookcase, pl some plants, you know, lovely relaxing plants here and here. A little bit of a bin in the corner as well. We're going to see if we can get to level three. A lightheaded poster. I don't know if it'll let me put it there, actually. We'll put another one back here. There we go. Level three. Yeah, there's an invalid item. It's that poster. New technology. We've been contacted by Bungle Technologies, who run various research hospitals across the county. They have an interesting proposition for us. Their psychi psychiatry license was recently revoked due to an incident with... Well, it's best not to get into it. They want to send us psychiatry patients in exchange will allow us to buy some of their latest technology. Until our organization acquires a research license, we need all the technologies we can get our hand on. So if I go and check over here, yeah, we're prestige level two. Um, you know what, let's get, some, let's get a window over here. There we go, level three. Let's leave that there, very, very nice room. So we need to get our hospital to level three and we need to cure patient psychiatry. So we're gonna have to build some more stuff. Getting to level three should be fairly easy. Um, Are these guys Freddie Mercury? What's going on here? They have like Mercuritis or something? Quinitis? All right, I'm very curious to see what that disease will be. Let's go ahead and get some toilets up. We'll just go three by three. That's gonna be fine. Uh, didn't look like the last set were particularly busy. So this should be plenty over here. I'm still gonna get a sink. We'll get a hand dryer over here. That gets us to level two building. All right, we're gonna call that good enough. And so we've got the general stuff. We need a psychiatrist. Oh, oh, have he had not actually hired it? Was just in the list? Psychiatry, okay. We're gonna hire you. And there's another shrink over here. General practice. I don't know if I should get the second psychiatrist yet or what. So have you been diagnosed? You're a mock star, oh! Oh, that's great! Patients believe themselves to be one of the greatest rock stars the world has ever seen, but are sadly Gaga. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get a, a, a you know, I'll get a general diagnosis here. Boom, boom. Okay, and again, we'll get it to at least the level two. Excellent. And then I'm gonna build a ward next to it. Needs a nurse, yes, and we'll need some more nurses over here. Oh, there's another doorway over here. Okay, let's not block that. Um, we may not be able to fit as many things into this ward as the last one, but I think that'll be okay. We'll get you there. And, oh, I can't get the bed in that spot. Well, we'll have, we'll have enough room for two people in the ward. I don't know if that's ideal, but we'll get it started. New technology. Bungle Technologies have given us access to some of their latest technology, a pharmacy drug mixer upgrade and a general diagnosis easy scan machine upgrade. If we buy these for our machines, they will become more powerful, helping us diagnose and cure more patients. To upgrade a machine, we'll need a janitor with mechanics qualifications. Select machine, choose the upgrade option. Qualified janitor will then upgrade the machine over time. Okay. 
Uh, I think you're waiting for a pharmacy, so let's go ahead and get one down here. Boom. Uh, rotate. Excellent. And filing cabinet. Bin. That's level two, but I want to plant in here as well. All right, hit OK. Let's hire a janitor. Okay, mechanics and ghost busting. So Candace over here. Oh, we already had a janitor, so it might have been okay. Upgrade to drug mixer two. Improved and all new recipes, 25% more treatment power. Done. And we will need a nurse. Probably need more than one. There's your pharmacy skill. Excellent. We'll get you in here. And we may need one for the ward. There's not a request right now. What? Oh! I think you've been cured of being a mock star. Look at this with the microphone and everything. Ah, this is great. Uh, we're gonna get some chairs for these, for all these people who are just sitting around. Boom, boom. We'll get you a bookcase over here for some entertainment. Over at the front, we're gonna get uh, some benches here and here. And over here, we'll get a, I wanna rotate snack machine drinks machine. Let's get the leaflet stand over here. That, that seems like a pretty good fit. Okay. So we need to upgrade a machine, which we're working on. Oh yeah, we can upgrade the easy scan, which is this. There we go. More diagnostic powers. Excellent. Boom. Done. We're burning through a lot of money, but I think it'll be okay. We are waiting for a nurse over here, so let's hire a second nurse. We don't have one with uh, ward management, unfortunately. But, um, you know what? Diagnosis, that's something else that we're going to need in the ward. So let's get you started. Okay. I think that's almost done upgrading. Ta-da! Pan's Lab unlocked. New machine upgrade is complete. Make sure we've got a few fire extinguishers dotted around to keep our pressure between safes. Right. Bungle Technologies was, are grateful for continued continue support of their psychiatry patients and given us access to one of their machines, the extract a pan This high-tech gadget is great for removal of unwanted kitchen utensils. Look out for people in need of this. Continue expanding the hospital to unlock more technologies. Buying another plot of land nearby will give us more space to develop the hospital. Ooh. Yes, I have not been placing down some extinguishers. We'll get one in this room. And we'll get one, um, we'll get one over here. And one in that hallway. Okay. You can construct new hospital buildings to give us more space to expand. Okay. Hover over plots of, plots of land. Oh, plot four. Three. Two. Ah, okay. Exciting. So this must be plot one. That's okay. Cure three patients in the pans lab. Well, all right. I don't know if we need, we have uh, lightheaded patients. Oh, it needs to be four by four. Hang on a sec. What's a good spot for that then? There's more doors and things. Uh, over here in this corner. I think I like that. Pan's Lab. Is that like Pan's Labyrinth? Okay, it's a big magnet. We'll put you in there. It went to level two right away. I guess that'll do. This seems like a room that could use a fire extinguisher though. And if we're doing that, we may go all the way up to level three. Little plants. Some more windows. Level three is pretty challenging, actually, to get over here. Some random posters. One more. There we go. Bam. Upgrading machine will make it more effective. I do know that. We can't, we can't upgrade you, but that's fine. So we've got this. Diagnostics. You're working on there. We've got some people cured. Not much queuing right now, which is good to see. On the other hand, more patients would be more better. Oh, we don't have a break room. Let me get one tucked in over here, I think. Break room. Oh, staff room is what it's called. That's why I couldn't don't find it. <laughs> don't forget to tip your doctor. Go, plenty of chairs, drinks machine, snack machine. I don't think the drink machine is flush to the wall. There we go. We'll get a bookcase in here too. And a plant and a bin. I want to get it up to the next level. Here, we'll keep putting down these posters everywhere. 
Excellent. Lovely. I guess the different rooms just have different, um, um, flooring and whatnot. So you can choose doctors, nurses, ah, oh, you can, you can organize these rooms by type. What was this? New disease! Lazy bones! Skeletal fatigue caused by a lack of calcium in the diet. Upon diagnosis, the patient should be immediately rushed to a ward where they must sleep for several days while being fed milk and cookies by a nurse. Oh! Oh my god, that's so cute! Oh, this one's got the pan disease. Right here. So, we've got to keep them in the ward to figure out the fact that they've got their head stuck in a pan. I strongly suspect we're going to need a larger ward than this. Ooh, you need a uh, reception person in the front. They're probably just on a break. Is that you? Yeah, junior assistant over here. I mean, I guess that's fine. We can just wait for a bit. It's not like we have a huge queue. We'll be able to process it fairly quickly. Oh! Staff challenge! I'd really... I'd love to have a really big plush staff room to relax in my break. How about it? Get a level 4 staff room. 180 days to do it. Well... We got a level 3. Can I just... Make it bigger. Okay, that's that's one thing. Oh, can I not? I guess I can't get it there. I can get it there, although I'll probably make the poster no longer be good. So we will move the poster. Let's see. Um, we will move the, the sofa back to here. And then... Items. Can we unlock some more? Yeah, let's get him a television. Oh, you know what? I think I want the coffee table. How much money do I have? Coffee table and bean bag. Coffee table here. Unlock the bean bag. Who doesn't want to relax in a bunch of bean bag? We'll get one in the corner. It's like the automat, the the ultimate sort of cozy, relaxy spot. And yeah, it looks like you really free turn the uh, the bean bags. What are we at in this room? Oh, it's level four! No, no, it's the hospital's level four. This room's still way level three. Dang. Although some of these are fairly cheap to unlock. And a lot of these um, items are not specific to the room. Yeah, this might not be improving the level as much. If we can get an arcade machine or something, that'd be good. Well, we'll see. New illness, pandemic has been discovered. Involuntary attachment to kitchen utensils causing extremely low levels of culinary skill or caused by. The pan must be carefully removed with a massive magnet. I want to look. Oh, we need a doctor over here for the extracted pan. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and hire another doctor. That's going to be, I'm sure, fine. Uh, let's get this one. It's another psychiatrist. Plus, you can do other things, so that's okay. Do you know you can adjust the prices? Yes, I know. Bogwarts has been discovered. I thought we'd already discovered that. Maybe at this hospital it's new. So, oh, right over here. I want I want to witness the depanification. The extracted pan. Janitor required? Is it? No. Seems hard to believe. Okay, you're gonna come around the back. Put your head here. Okay, oh, they're clamped. He's been clamped into the bottom. Pop it off his head. And there you go. Easy peasy. Easy money. Staff request. Yeah, current level, hmm. I'm very concerned about this. <gasps> he died. What did he die of? He died of lazy bones. Maybe we didn't have a ward for him quickly enough. Or her, her. Meryl died. Meryl, stop. Oh dear, patients have been to appear to have returned from the dead. I need a janitor for the ghost capture qualification. I believe we've got one. In fact, there we go. Get on the uh, the Ghostbuster. Not the du the Dustbuster, but the Ghostbuster. Uh, that might be a trademark infringement. And there we go. Done and done. It's okay. Dead people are, are still useful for things. So, is there anything I haven't built? Well, I don't have a deluxe clinic. Oh, and we do have a light bulb head over here. This gotta be a 3x3 so we can fit it in. Well, that's a 3x4, but I guess that'll be fine. To the whole of Two Point County. And if you're listening to us from the Boom. newly opened hospital, just there we go. Up that volume, and play. Alright. The so there we go, we'll be ready like to go the there. What is this? Is that the length of the queue? 42 hours of music from the background band. Enjoy. Doesn't seem to be a queue. Oh, it's a queue for this room. Yes, we need another general diagnosis room. Um, actually, GP's office. That's what that is. There's 
It's not going to be as big and swanky. Oops, that's a dumb spot for that. Come on. There's a queue outside GP's office. Yes, it is. And it is worth building another one, which I've just done. And I suppose we will hire another doctor. This is very expensive, but look at the noble of skills. Byron? Yeah, let's get Byron over here. Boom. Done. And we'll get some places for people to sit outside of here. Doom and Doom, which will also be shared a little bit by this room. Tell you what, we'll go ahead and put another chair there as well. Excellent. Okay. We do have to own another building. We have to cure more patients. So, I wonder how much money we need. Portishead has been discovered. Portishead affects both body and mind. Once thought to be caused by proximity to sea air, it's now known to be chiefly caused by living in Portishead. All right. I don't know which one, which disease Portishead is. So, if we want to expand, 25 grand. Well, we'll do it. Money's getting quite low. I think we need a loan. It's possible. Oh, we have to wait several days for that to get built. I'm happy it's being done early. I think you're looking for a trash can, but you've got one. So you should be okay. And we do need a nurse over here. We've got quite a few. You're over here. We might still need a run redundant nurse, though. I think I'll, I'll, I'll save some money. Get Lester over here. Who's going to stop the smell of the roses? You got patients coming in. Okay. If we click on here, Q length is only one. Q length of two. I think it's possible that we just got the doctor was on break for a while, and that's what accumulated this Q over here. You need a bathroom. We've got a bathroom, so you should be okay. Ooh, we've got like no money. Lightheadedness has been rediscovered. Okay, that's fine. We're ready to go and treat that. Did you know, earn kudosh organization by increasing the star rating of our hospitals and completing other challenges. Okay. You're over here, level four staff room. Can we do it? Can I take this? Um, not items. I want to edit this room. Can I move it? I want to move this staff room here. Now, we'll still need one that's fairly close to the main office. just a level three staff room. Dang. Okay. So size didn't help it as much as I would have liked. Health inspector has arrived. I don't know how bad that's going to be. Maybe it's fine. Let's get some more large sodas, or sofas in here. I mean, we can see the level increase. Here, we'll get a pair of them facing here. We'll get another coffee table in between them, which can't quite fit. Hang on. There we go. More posters. Boom! There we go. Level four. Quest completed. I don't like that they have to go so far. We might still want to build a guest room over here, but that's good. So the health inspector is visiting the ward. We do have two janitors, so presumably we should be okay. Is there much of a queue for the ward? No. Just one person in the queue right now, which isn't too bad. Although, the ward does get used for quite a long time, so there may be a fair wait. There's the health inspector. We got some money again. VIP patient. One of Roderick's cushions... Makeup crew is unwell and looking for treatment. We'll be rewarded if we treat this VIP VI patient. Should we have him sent here? Yes. We have 180 days to cure him. That's fine. And we successfully completed the request from Tobias over here for the staff room. So he's happier. And we get some kibosh. Oh, 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 oh. Another death. Right next to the health inspector. That can't possibly be good. What did you have? Lightheadedness. Yeah, I think you were in a queue for a while. Waiting for a bathroom. We do have one over here, so you should be okay. There you go, get sucked up. Oh, this person's terrified of the ghost. I ain't afraid of no ghost. So we have to get our hospital over to level five. Staff promotion, excellent. So again, more rooms. I think what I might do is build another general diagnosis room over here. 
might be redundant to have two. I suppose it depends on how quickly people come in. I'll just get that. I don't have to... Oh, here we go. Bam! One star hospital. Like lightning, you have made a mockery of your detractors by stacking, striking a second time. You're commended on your endeavors into the inner workings of machines in the human mind, respectfully. Now focus on building your two-headed empire, or add a third head by opening a new hospital in Flottering, as it's currently not much of an empire. So we unlocked Flottering, Cardiology, and the Deluxe Olux 2. I'm gonna continue as is. I'm sure we can do more over here. Do you know we can compete with other hospitals in the area and earn more rewards by taking part in organization challenges? View available challenges by clicking on the tab in the top right. Challenges. Compete with other healthcare organizations in a range of time challenges. Earn extra rewards and bragging rights by triumphing over your rivals. Click on a rival organization from Two Point County or challenge hospitals owned by your Steam friends. Each challenge takes place over a number of months. You can compete at the same time as your rivals or at separate times, and your results are recorded by the Two Point Competition Committee. You will receive updates through the challenges on how each participant was doing at the stage of the competition. Hey! Compete against other organizations to diagnose the most patients. Interesting. So if we want to get another star here, we got to get the level nine, own three buildings, upgrade two machines. Well, we've already technically upgraded some, but uh, that's okay. We'll go and get a relatively large ward over here. Not to stay them to X -ray, uh, something like this. Get the door, get the desk over here. The changing room right next to that. Boom. 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 As close as possible over there. Excellent. Get you in here. We will request that there's an extra staff whenever possible. Because I'm sure we'll need some extra people over here for that. This will also increase our level. Hey, a new promotion. We can upgrade our deluxe Olox to make it more effective. Let's do it. And we can't upgrade this one. I could upgrade this easy scan here. That should satisfy our upgrade to machines. You know, your hygiene levels are low. The health of patients will deteriorate faster. Keep the hospital as clean as possible. Make sure toilets have sinks and place hand sanitizing dispensers. Do we have that unlocked? I don't think we do. Hand sanitizers? No. Natasha Windmill is unable to get where they want. You may need to rearrange things to unblock the route. Who where? Someone's just gonna stuck in the toilet? Inspection report! Mr. Jobsworth has sent us a report from recent visits, 30 pages, uh, so we haven't read it. But the conclusion reads, incredibly mediocre, with no feature that sway the overall product, neither negatively or positively outside of the realm of the ordinary. Nothing to complain about here, but not much to be happy about either. Challenge, impress the VIP with a nice hospital. Reward, oh, reputation points. Okay. At least I assume that's what R is. So, we'll go and... Ooh, that's really expensive. Well, this one's fairly pricey too, but we'll unlock that. That'll be our third building. Upgrades are queued. We're waiting for someone at the front desk. I'm gonna go and get a second assistant here. Rory Mayonnaise? No, we'll get Clint Watt over here, who's actually got the uh, better reputation, short temper, motivated. Yeah, that's fine. Let's get you down here. I think we already had someone coming back, but that's okay. What do we have? What is with you? Are you, did you just fart? No, you think you're juggling? What are you doing? Portis head. Huh. Might have too many nurses. I don't know. You got an appointment at the ward. We do have the second ward. You could just go over there instead of waiting here. I wonder if I should just close this ward. Encourage people to go to the other one. Staff promotion? Sure. You're waiting for a doctor over here. I know we've got some spare doctors. And we could take a look at our people, actually, and our staff. Uh, are these doctors? Yeah. Doctor needed in GP's office. There we go. So yeah, we've got one on break. He's been on break, or she's been on break for 13 days. Happiness, staff energy. So why are you not as happy as you could be? Thirst, hunger. I mean, we've got thirst quenchers all over the place. We don't have fountains. Staff challenges. What would you like? Challenge. Earn $100,000 in 90 days. That should be fine, actually. We should totally be able to do that. 
boom, two upgrades done. Hmm. You're waiting for a nurse to come and put you in bed, I think. There you go. This place is a queue. I mean, it's only a queue of two, but... Still, why is no one working here? I guess let's get an extra nurse. There you go, ward manager. And we'll drop you in here. Maybe some people will come what over to this ward instead now that there's someone there. Gardening. I mean, who doesn't like gardening? Digging let's up get another drinks machine. Soil, your hands right there. Bit of right next to the toilet. Use the toilet, get a drink. It looked like people now. were a little nope, thirsty over wait. here. This sewage pipes burst again. <laughs> No, so, and we got anyway, someone to come to get a drink right away, so they may only be wor willing to walk so far to get a drink. That is entirely possible. Hmm. No one queue for the shrink's office? I mean, most of these are going to be pretty idle most of the time. Any rooms I haven't built? Oh, we don't have cardiology. Although we don't know if anyone needs a cardiology lab yet. Making sick people run could produce interesting, maybe even eventful results. Alright, let's get a cardiology department built. 3 by 3 Here, let's do a 5 by 3 here, just because it'll fit in well. Treadmill is a go. Plant, plant. A bin. Fire extinguisher in case they run too fast. Some posters. Hey, at least you don't have lightheadedness. And done. It does annoy me that this is not quite... There you go. Centered the right way. Excellent. Special report. Good news, you cured, cured the VIP patient. A generous donation they made to the hospital. Woo! Should also help us earn more money, maybe? Actually, I don't think that, that upgraded uh, up that ticker, because otherwise it would be done. Wouldn't it? Was it 100,000? No, I guess we only got 10,000, so it probably did up that. I mean, expanding to over here this quickly may not have been necessary. That should be okay. Let's run this on fast forward. Big Q over here. We have multiple ones of these. And some of you people are waiting for entertainment. Staff promotion. New disease! Freudian lips! Tendency to pout excessively when faced with a camera. Caused by a buildup of lewd thoughts in the cerebral cortex. A psychiatrist must use a subconscious tap to drain the excess thoughts into a beaker, after which they can be safely disposed of in an incinerator. We'll send the patient for treatment immediately. Wow. Got some chairs over here. How's our shrink? It's got a queue of one, of two. It's not too bad. Dr. Joey Asparagus. Queue of two over here. No one here at all. And, ooh, someone's walking away. I think that symbol means they've been cured, though, so I think it's all right. Ba -dump, ba -dump, ba -da -da -dump. What? Oh, a bit of a mess here. Thank you very much for cleaning it up, Mr. Jan Etor. <gasps> Awards! It's a countdown. Show me the award! Show me the money! Hey, hey! All right, I didn't exit out of the award show this time. So what do we have? Tell me. The ballot. Open! And the winner is... The Burp Award for Doctor of the Year. Oh, that went away really fast. I think it went to someone else. Nurse of the Year. Holistics. Yep, that's for someone else as well. Oh, man. Okay, open everything. Did we win any? We got another Rising Star Award. award. Uh, last time was won by Candida Mann. Okay. New illness, illness, monobrow, extreme hair growth caused by excessive consumption of both highbrow and lowbrow entertainment. The monobrow must be carefully removed and placed in a secure container to prevent it from escaping. We'll send the patient for treatment immediately. Wow. Staff challenge. Ah, oh, we successfully did it. Hooray! Still need to bring up the hospital level, but we're getting there. Now, we, don't, we still don't have any new rooms. So, I think this might be... Another time to flip to a new hospital. We could go and revisit an old one and add these new rooms in here to get it to the next level. That's probably a good idea, actually. A warm so, greeting to you all. Shush, shush. I don't want you to talk right now. Shush. Before we go and end the episode and go to a new hospital, I'm going to flip back over to the first one. 
do 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 in a hog's port over here. Excellent. Because we got a bunch of new rooms, so we need to get up to hospital level six. So we can do that by having more rooms, and we may as well because there's going to be a point to it at this point. So we'll get up a cardiology over there. And there, there we go, level two cardiology. We'll just start with that. We can improve them later. That's gonna be okay. Um, we'll get a psychiatry office over here. We'll put the door there. All right, we'll just get you set up so we've got it. Okay, we're at level six, excellent. So I don't really have to do more, although we may as well. Pan's lab is very expensive, but let's go ahead and get it done anyway. Boom, it's a big room for a big machine. All right, what do we have here? Ward emergency, group of ward patients have just left a holistics hospital. They are now, and are now moisturized and looking for further treatment. We'll be rewarded if we treat this group of patients. We have them sent here. Cure five patients with bed face. Yeah, that should work okay. We've got a fairly large ward. I think we should be fine. Let it play. All we have to do is earn a bunch of money and cure a bunch of patients right now to get to the two star hospital level. That sounds like a good idea. I mean, I could put down some more plants and things over here. I think, uh, if nothing else, it would be a good idea to have that and a bench. And let's have a bench over here and a drinks machine. People don't seem to get as hungry, or as hungry as they do thirsty, but here, we'll get you in here as well. There. All kinds of staff and doctors might be interested in using this. Done and done. It's working on our ward patients. Could we, like, prioritize them. Oh, yes, we have a, a psychiatry room, but no doctor qualified for it. There's no there's no doctor available that's qualified, unfortunately. Hospital reputation is now great. This will attract even more patients and staff. Nice. We've earned a bunch of money. We just got to cure some more patients. Hopefully we cure the ones that we've got the specific mission for. People coming in here. Uh oh, death. More death. I don't think you're lightheaded. This was treated in time. Oh, the treatment failed. That's what happened. Every now and again, it fails. People die. Oh, well. Build a large room. Fill them with interesting items to increase their prestige. Staff working there will be happier. Patients visiting will become happier, too. So people are scared. I believe we do have a janitor over here who can take care of this for us. He or she may just be busy. Might be this fella over here. Cleaning up ectoplasm. Oh, no. Yeah, so you don't actually have the, the ghost sucker tech. You're just cleaning up a mess. Let's go ahead and make sure. We'll hire an extra janitor if need be. No, none of these can do it. Hmm. Is it you? Who compost? No. You. Oh, you're not a janitor. Hang on. Surely we must have... We have two janitors. Yeah. Sean over here. Oh, it's taking a break. That's what's happening. So hence no ghost busting. The ghosts might go away on their own. Oh no, there it is. Just popping around. Now you are still, you're cured of bed face. But you still have, what is the deal with the light above your head? Is that really happy? I don't know. Or maybe you had more than one disease. Face eating clowns. Double psychiatrist. Oh, he's got level two. Yeah, Lando. Join the party, man. Excellent. <gasps> Yay! Star 2 Hospital! If you proceed at your current pace, you will have achieved everything you can near your founding establishment soon enough. I can sense your confidence inflating. Carefully, don't build yourself up to it for an even greater fall. We unlocked Salty Snack Machine. Ooh, lovely. And to get to the next level, we would just have to cure more patients and earn more money, which we should be able to do. What I might do... Uh, well, we're going to put a cut in here. And next episode, we're going to start on the newest hospital, which is over here, Flottering. Very excited to see how that'll go. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.